السلام علیکم و رحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ ہیلو اینڈ ویلکم چلڈرن ٹو آر سائنس کلاس سو ٹو ڈے وی آر گوئنگ ٹو اسٹارٹ وتھ آر لیسن نمبر ٹو تیتھ پیج نمبر ٹوینٹی تھری نیو ورڈس ان سیزرس کینائنس پریمولاز ڈینٹسٹ پلپ acid cavity molars let's study how our teeth help us okay and the different kinds of teeth then we will also study the structure of teeth all right and what are the different things that are uh, that causes our teeth to dk and how we can keep uh, we can take care of our teeth okay all these things we are going to study in this lesson so let's begin name of the chapter teeth so we will today learn about teeth all right children open your mouth and count your teeth the number of teeth in your mouth and you have to write it down on the black card teeth help us to break food into smaller pieces and now in this session we will understand about the teeth and its types that is milk and permanent teeth let's do this so you have a picture here some pictures and some questions look at the picture understand observe and then answer the question which part of the body helps to break the food can you swallow the food without cutting and chewing and are all teeth in your mouth same let's check the responses which part of the body helps to break the food teeth can you swallow the food without cutting and chewing no are all the teeth in your mouth same no there are different types Let's understand the concept of teeth. Let's know more about teeth. The teeth present in our mouth helps to break the food into smaller particles. They help us to cut and chew food until it is small enough to be swallowed. So without teeth, it would be difficult to break the food into smaller particles. So now it is telling you about the teeth, how teeth functions, what is the role of teeth. So the teeth in our mouth what does it do they help us to break the food into smaller particles so that we can swallow it properly because you cannot swallow the big bites as it is you have to the food has to be you know cut and chewed first and let's discuss about types of teeth we have two types of teeth in our lifetime so throughout the life we have two types of teeth milk teeth and permanent teeth milk teeth at the age of 3 years a child has 20 teeth in the mouth this set of teeth is temporary and is known as milk so what do you understand by temporary that means it is not permanent they will fall off one day and then the teeth will reoccur right so at the age of 3 years a child has 20 teeth not more than that and this set of teeth is per not permanent and it is temporary therefore they are called milk teeth milk teeth are whiter in color than the permanent teeth they also help in development of speech so when the child is small 3 years 4 years these teeth these temporary teeth help them develop their speech also second is permanent teeth when the child is about 6 years old the milk teeth begin to fall off new teeth start appearing in their places this set of teeth is permanent and is called permanent teeth between the age of 17 and 21 we normally get the last set of molars and have 32 permanent teeth in our mouth So children now that you know about teeth and the types of teeth let's do some quick check of what we know about it now if the given statement is about milk teeth and permanent teeth you have to write m for the milk teeth and write p for the statement if it is about permanent teeth so 
let's check the responses here so at the age of three child has temporary teeth so this is about milk teeth these are whiter so this is about milk teeth at the age of six temporary teeth starts to fall off this is about milk teeth now these teeth, teeth help in digestion by producing saliva this is about permanent teeth let's do another quick check so here this is true and false so thumbs up for the true statement and thumbs down for a false statement mm -hmm. and here we go the first statement is teeth present in the mouth help to break the food into smaller pieces so you have to write down either true or false or thumbs up or thumbs down at the age of three a child has 20 teeth permanent teeth are whiter than the milk teeth adults have 32 permanent teeth in their mouth we have two types of teeth in our lifetime milk teeth or permanent teeth let's check the responses so for the first statement that teeth are present in the mouth help to break the food into smaller particles yes or no yes at the age of three a child has 20 teeth this is true or false true permanent teeth are whiter than the milk teeth no milk teeth are whiter than the permanent teeth adults have 32 permanent teeth in the mouth yes we have two types of teeth in our lifetime milk teeth and permanent teeth true let's do some assessment so these are the fill in the blanks you have to fill the correct answer in the blanks given dash present in the mouth helps to break the food into smaller pieces at the age of three a child has dash teeth dash teeth are whiter than the dash teeth adults have dash permanent teeth in their mouth we have two types of teeth in our lifetime dash and dash so you have to answer these as per your understanding of the concept about teeth and types of teeth okay now let's check the responses what you have written so teeth present in the mouth help to break the food into smaller pieces at the age of three a child has 20 teeth milk teeth are whiter than the permanent teeth adults have 32 permanent teeth in their mouth we have two types of teeth in our lifetime milk teeth and permanent teeth so these are the answers so children i hope you all understood how teeth help us what are milk teeth and what are permanent teeth right so in next class we will study the different kinds of teeth hmm? i'll see you in your next class assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh